So we've got another camper van. And I've only just driven it, I've not seen inside it. I've purposely not seen inside on it so we can both have a look at it together. It's a Globe Course Scout. Road Scout. Road Scout even um, a 130 um, it's on the Fiat Ducato it's 2.3 I'd say it's around about five and a half meters would you say yeah nice looking color nine 2020 and it's yeah 69 plate but it is a 20 um, nice color again I keep on again I love the cab and what have we got and there we go what have we got under here so we've got the cassette toilet Oh, that's okay that's okay i thought that was going to be awkward <clears throat> to actually get the cassette out but it's not it's quite quite easy and again i suppose you could put your cleaning solutions there so again good storage um i like the little magnet that holds it up right so flew for the heating and hot water system so the heating system is going to be round about here 230 hookup and just noticing here, we do have a gas low fill it there. So the van's gonna have a gas low system on. So it's gonna be here. Let's let's have a look. Keep the camera low because I don't want people to look inside. I haven't looked inside it yet either. So let's have a look. So if we open this up here, there we go. There's your gas low system. So there's two good bottles there. And then you're guessing there is going to be a fixed bed up here. But look at the storage we do have underneath. Quite a bit of storage. And that's going to be the jack and what wheel brace. What do you mean, what other bits have we got? We've got a tally. And we've got a hook up. And you've got a bit of a mat. Happy? Yeah. Okay. It's a lot more demanding, you know, than Kev. <clears throat> Kev's at least nice and easy. We're going this way now, Finn. Fresh water filler, so that's for putting the water into the fresh water tank. And then let's have a look at this van. Electric step, and let's make our way inside. So first of all, let's put some lights on. And um, we'll switch that on there. And just have a quick look. Dead simple control panel there. And then there we've got the Truma system and the iNet so you can work it off your phone. So for the heating and for the hot water. But let's have a look at the back. So we've got the fixed bed at the back. And a nice little design there. A little step for you to step onto. And then we do have, let's have a look. Yep, yeah, we've got storage. They ain't the biggest lockers in the world, but adequate for the size of van. You yeah, haven't got storage again. I'm just finding the two spotlights, and these are my favourite lights ever. It's mine, and I can put it there. And it switches back on, and then I can steal somebody else's and put it there. Now, while we're here, let's just have a look. We've got sink with the taps. Um, yeah, we've got the, well, the silvery type of switches. So, and then we do have a three burner, a three, two burner hob. It's been a long day today, Finn, hasn't it? I'll put them keys here. And then there we go. That's going to be a compressor fridge. Yeah, compressor fridge. A little bit of a freezer. I do like the compressor fridges. Um, and then we've got one, two, three drawers, ample size. Now, come here. Just a quick one, Jace, while you're on the kitchen bit, just mention about how you can pull that up. I was going to get to that when I got there. What we do, as Fink rightly put in mind, um, we have got a little extender there to throw a little bit more prep area, basically. Can I get on with what I'm doing now? Yeah, Thanks. Right, so let me just show you this. This is interesting. If we take this around there, and then just come and have a look at that. I really like this. It, don't forget, it is going to be small because it is a compact camper. Let's pull that out. How nice is that? That's really, really nice. And it doesn't have to be a big sink. That's really nice. And then it just goes up out of the way. Nice finish that, isn't it? And then what we do have, I can sit here and then I've got my other, which closes. You see, now what this also does double up as well. Let me just show you. Have a look down here. 
I'm going to lift that up. It doubles up. Can you see down there? There's the shower as well. So that goes over that way there. Can you see there, Finn? Yeah. That goes across. It's going to be a bit awkward. Let me just bring the camera in. It's better. I've got a better angle here for you now to show you. That comes across there. And then what we do have then, this will come off onto there. And then we've got our own shower area. So that pulls around. And you can just see in here how it goes around like that. Oh, I'll just take my shower out. So that's something I've not seen before in a camper van. And it, it, it's making a good use of a small camper van, actually. Um, a good it's a good shower area. I've not seen that before. We've got the spotlights in above as well. Uh, I do like that. So fixed bed. We've done the back. Let's move to the front. And then we've got the dinette. More than likely, yeah, they do. Bring this forward. And there we go. These swivel around. A couple of little cup holders in there. Now we can make a little bed up. If you can just see here, Finn, if we take this off here, we can drop this down here across to make a bed area. And I assume the seat will be there. So it is it's only going to be a small bed. And at the end of the day, the van is not really just a two berth. So it could probably just for a toddler um, or a small child there for making the bed up. We do have the two belted seat belts. And then I will just swing that around there. Um, we're doing everything back to front today. So I do want to show you the cab. So let's have a look at the cab. Um, basically, it's not happy because we've got this... Um, there we go, we have got the step out. Now, what we do have, we've, the van does have the blinds that go all the way across. Also, again, driver and passenger side. And then we have got um, electric windows, electric mirrors, steering wheel, I've not seen cruise control, um, CD radio. Oh, sorry, we've got cruise control down there. Um, we do have the reversing camera as well. Just the one camera on there. Yeah, there it is back. What I do like here as well, we have got a camera here, dash a dash cam. cam. Yeah, I don't know what it was. Do have a dash cam. Um, air con, we've got the blown air. And more importantly, this van is automatic, automatic. So there's another, another big bonus for us there. So I'm just gonna shove this now. Um, good size window blinds fly screens not going to get that one wrong and then we do have the window on here which i call the click clacks click 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 clack um so good size opening window and we do have them on the passenger side and we have got two windows as well at the back if you can see there so we'll open that back up the other thing as well that we've got on the hab door, we have got a nice fly screen there. You can leave that door open then, can't you? Yeah, yeah as, Finn, as Finn says, we can leave that door open and we're not going to get bit or any flies or anything coming in, especially if you're going up into Scotland or wherever you are in the world where there's lots of flies. Um, let's talk quickly about this van. It's a Globecard Road Scout R. Oh, um, it's a 2020. It's a two berth, four belted seats. Could be a little bit. It could be a two and a half berth, I'd say. Um, it's done just over 2,000 miles. Fiat Decato automatic, 2.3 litre. Uh, so it's more than likely going to be a cam belt. Euro 6 turbo diesel. It's only had the one owner. It's 5.41 metres in length, 2.5 metres high. Um, so it is a titchy, titchy camper van. And then we've got, it has got solar on the roof as well. Electric step, air con. Um, we've got the blown air, gas and electric. Water, fresh water capacity, 95 litres. Waste water is 92 litres. Power steering, cruise control, CD radio, um, fixed bed, fridge, hob, which I've just shown you all the way through. So this is a, this is a nice camper. It, it, it does a lot of things. Obviously, we're never going to pack. It's going to be packed out like a motorhome is going to be. But we've got everything we need. We've got the fridge. We've got the heating. We've got the hot water. We've got the hob. Um, and then what we've got is what I really do like is that wash. I know I keep going on about it. Is this area here. I feel like I'm on Star Trek, basically. Star uh, Trek. 
Star Trek. Yeah, Star Trek. I feel like with this here, see how this comes out. So if you've enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. But well, I go like this and I close and I go, Baby up, Scotty! You still here? Beat me up, Scotty! Wave. Yeah. I'm in it for keepsake, in a fair with the cleat lace. Beat foot with the bare face and a slick tie. That's what she say. She left good, she a big tease.